Previously on In Transit, we paddled to the town of Sibula, Iowa, met Tom from Bonfire Pizza, and scored a guitar. On day 24, we paddle all day passing the Quad Cities for a total of 50 miles ending in Andalusia, where our parents and my girlfriend are coming to meet us. After being on the river for three and a half weeks, we're excited to see some familiar faces. Hi! 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 My sweetie! Hi! It's so No, I love you! Yeah, there you go. Hey, okay, good. Yeah, I like it. It's been this long. I haven't seen you. How many miles? 50 miles. It's so awesome, What do I smell like? Like everything. Like Bio and River? No, you don't smell like Bio. You smell like everything. All I do is, all I do is, like, I turned around and, like, that noise scared him to hell. And he went, ah! I'm like, no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> it's a like After catching up over a couple beers and river stories, we call it a night at the Hillside Inn. Thankfully, my parents have a car to take us back to the dock where our canoes are in the morning. Bye. Bye. See you guys in 20 miles. It's day 25, and as you can tell, Patty's here with us. She's gonna paddle for a couple days. Right, Patty? Yes. Yes. Are you ready? Yes. Try to go like in. Okay. Like like perpendicular to the boat. And like then this. Push back. Yeah. Okay. Oh, lazy. After Patty quickly got the hang of being on the boat, we canoed 20 more miles to the town of Muscatine to meet with our parents for lunch. For a quick bite, we chose to eat at Made Right. I've never heard of this franchise, but apparently it's very popular around these parts. So we decided to try it out where it all began. Their specialties are the signature sandwich, which resembles a sloppy joe, as well as a large selection of malts. In order for us to stay awake after eating all that food, we cooled off at the local fountain in town before we got onto the river. Continuing downriver, we paddle 16 more miles to a random parking lot attached to a boat landing where we'll camp out for the night. It is day 26 and it's a special day because it's Peter's birthday. Yep, it's my birthday, and I wouldn't celebrate it any other way. Paddling on the river is just fine with me. So we paddle through the morning and meet up with my brothers on the side of the river, where they were recently approached by a captain of a barge, inviting us on board for some breakfast. He's gonna take his boats and pick us up and take us to the barge. So. Hey, happy birthday. This is a nice this gift. Is a good, this is a good, good. Heading upstream, we hop on Chad's boat to catch up to the barge, where they'll hook us up with some breakfast and take us on a tour. Yeah, hitting some waves, going crabbing. This isn't your average barge. Chad's been running a non-for-profit for years dedicated to cleaning and preserving our nation's rivers. Chad and his crew, along with his volunteers, have collected over six million pounds of debris since he started doing this. Awesome, wow, wow. Since when did you start this? 13 years ago. 13 years, wow. Since we're getting further and further away from our canoes, it's time for Chad to take us back to our boats before we end up back in Minnesota. Come on, bud. Alright, guys. See you. See you later. It's nice to know that there are people out there on the river cleaning it up. It's cool that people like Chad exist. For the day, we paddle a total of 30 miles and end in the town of Burlington. Hey, to you. Okay. Ooh, 
All right. All right, Don, look at this right. beautiful Welcome to Sabula, Sabula. I was where I want to be. 